Okay, testing. You touch UHF handheld reader. Okay, and see that. Okay, and currently we just do an inventory test, and uh, you can see that we choose the UHF application, and click it. Okay, and now you see we just uh, using the inventory. Okay, okay, and we setting the parameters here. You can see that. Okay, parameter setting is this thirty three dBm. And the tag here. Okay, this is hard text for garment hard text. So the read distance is three meters, and uh, RFID inside here, and it also has three bar structure, and which is here. So it also has a pin to insert here. So you can just uh, touch into the uh, garment. Okay. So, we put all the tag here. Okay, totally, what one hundred, one hundred hard tag here. So we just use this inventory model to check. Okay. You see that? Okay. Now we stop it, and it has one hundred and fifty five tags surrounding, and. And there actually are also some tags not here, not uh, belong to this tag because you can see the tags of the gum tags are starting with 3008. Okay, so the E22, 20, 20, E20, uh, E28 are not the gum tags here, so it can include in many tags here. So we can also to to get a better better result, we can just uh, uh, launch the filter models. So we can just filter filter the text uh, starting with E two, and uh, we just continue and clear and scan it again. Okay, it's ninety one, ninety four. Ninety-seven. Okay. Now you can see that we have just fitting the text starting with E two, so you can just use E three here, E three here. So this is the text. When eventually all the three starting with three o eight. So this is inventory test and uh, because. Uh, the tag will stuck to stack together and also has a metal interference so the result need to be uh and you sometimes you, if you want to get better better result you need to uh such as shaking the shaking the text here so you can get better i better result here okay it's 97 and totally one hundred. So you can see that. Okay. We can continue. Okay, one hundred and nine. So many tags are not belong to here, for this one, this one, this one, this one. So this is all about inventory models. Thanks for watching.